Okay, so here I am on the FAMZOO.com homepage, and I just want to give you a super quick tour of what FAMZOO looks like for the typical family. So I've just clicked on the sign in button, and I'm going to sign in as dad of the Tiger family. Let me type in my password here. And the first thing I'll see is an overview page for my family. You can see my family over here. I've got dad, I've got mom, I've got big sis and cub and maybe an inspirational message that I'd like the family to see. Now the main area is a series of sections. The first section here is for the account balances in my virtual bank. And since I'm signed in as a parent, I can see information for everybody. I've got these tabs here for each family member. If I were a child, I would only see the information for myself. So I'm going to click on Cub and see just Cub's information, for example. The next section down shows account activity that's both recent credits and debits in the accounts, which I can expand a little bit here. And also upcoming credits and debits for maybe allowances I've set up or interest or even automatic debits to my kids' accounts. This next section down is allowances, which can be split between multiple accounts and that can be a great way to teach kids about charitable giving and long-term savings. Underneath that, I've got savings goals, which don't have to be just for spending. Here I've got a savings goal set up for some charitable giving that I'd like to do, or that my child would like to do. And then finally, checklists. Now checklists are neat because they can also be linked to the virtual bank, so you can set up chore lists that credit an account, for example, when an item is checked off. But they don't have to be tied to the, the bank, and you can use them for anything, like to-dos or wish lists are nice because you can share them with the the whole family. So let's go up here and let's assume that Cub would like to credit the 25 cents that may be found laying around in the sofa that might have fallen out of someone's pocket. And so I put a quarter there and let's say spare change and I'll hit credit. Now remember the way this works is that you as the parent manage the real money and you're just keeping track of what you owe your kids here. So you can see that the balance updated. And if I want to see all of the transactions behind this, maybe the credits and the debits, and by the way, these plus and minus buttons are only here if you're a parent, then I can click on the amount there. And here you'll see basically the online equivalent of a traditional check register with the credits and the debits, and we can page through the history. So that's a very, very quick tour. And if you want to do some of these things from your mobile phone, you can also do that. And we tell you all about it on the mobile tab here. We've only just scratched the surface and there's tons more to see. You can come check out our site or our blog for more detailed info. And we're adding screenshots and videos all the time. Or you can just come by and sign up and try it out for yourself. It's free for the first two months and you don't have to enter any payment info up front. And a couple of months should be enough time to see whether FAMZOO is right for your family. So we hope to see you soon and thanks so much for watching.